Hi guys, welcome back to Advanced VR Fair. I'm Ben and in this video I will talk about a problem that is happening between Windows 11 and Oculus Link or Air Link. I'm not going to talk badly, on the contrary, it's a better operating system than Windows 10. It's modern, it's clear and it's more intuitive. It performs very well with all the games I tried so far. The only problem happened as soon as I connected the Quest 2 with Oculus Link cable or with Air Link. So if you have an Oculus headset, because I'm talking also about the Rift S, because this problem happened also on Rift S, you may have to wait before to install Windows 11. The problem that I encountered, and there never happened before, it happened only on Oculus Quest 2 with Cable Link or Air Link and with the Rift S. No matter if the game is native on the Oculus platform or on Steam VR, the Valve Index works perfectly and the virtual desktop on Oculus Quest 2 works great. And the problem is that by moving your head or your hands, no matter if you are already in game or if you are in home, there is is a strong stuttering that is essentially the scene you have in front of your eyes instead of going smoothly run as if it is at very very low frame rate I repeat this occurred only with Oculus link cable and with air link doing some tests with some monitoring tools for the frame rates I noticed that, that there is no drop so the problem it isn't hardware, thanks to the cough I'd say, because the hardware is the same that was working perfectly before. And also, doing some quick check on the system process, I realized that there were some of them that were sucking more resources, and I doubt that the problem was precisely the new operating system. A Google search also confirmed my doubt, because on Reddit and on Oculus forum there are many and many users that having the same problem. Solution? Unfortunately, I didn't find yet a solution, neither on the internet or trying on myself. And the only thing I could do is to pass again to Windows 10. So for you, if you're already passed to Windows 11 and you are experiencing this problem, I suggest you to roll back to Windows 10. And if you still are on Windows 10 and you are thinking about going to Windows 11, I suggest you to wait, because maybe with the first update of the new operating system, this problem will be fixed. Of course, I will keep trying on myself to find a solution, and if I find any, I will make you know as soon as possible. So stay tuned, and of course, if you have already a solution, write down in the comments. Thank you. Thanks for watching, like, share, subscribe, and ring the bell. From Benitzel, see you to the next one, and see you in VR. Hi guys.